They can expect a very candid, open, honest book all about sex and relationships that is filled with like advice and information, but also personal anecdotes. I like to think of it as being kind of like your wise best friend, maybe, but who still has a lot of questions of her own. I first got into vlogging about six years ago and it was because I watched a lot of YouTube and just really got into watching loads of videos and YouTubers and got really invested into the community. I started making videos about sex and relationships uh, like several months after that because I noticed that my audience were mostly young women and sex education was something that I was already thinking about like before I'd started making videos. In today's digital and very visual age, we receive a lot of messages about what the ideal body is, what is attractive and what is beautiful in terms of size, shape, weight, height, skin colour, hair. In fact, anything you can think of that is part of our external appearance. And through these messages, we are given a narrow list of acceptable body types. We are told what is beautiful and made to assume that everything that doesn't fit these ideals is not beautiful. Yeah, the audiobook, um, that was so much fun. I, like, it was also mentally exhausting. It's weird, you like sat down just talking for hours, which is like the weirdest hard work I've ever had to do. I'm gonna give a piece of advice that my mum gave me, which was that um, if you're not comfortable or ready to fart around someone, you're not ready to have sex with them. <laughs> which, <laughs> <laughs>